क्लास नाइन्थ सायन्स वर्कशॉप ऑफ लेसन नंबर ट्वेल्व स्टडी ऑफ साउंड हा वीडियो में आप मैथमेटिकल प्रॉब्लेम्स देखी अभ्यास आहोत क्या वीडियो शेवटपर्यंत पहा पत्पूर्वी हाय फ्रेंड्स वेलकम इन आवर ओन टीचर चैनल सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड टच द बेल आइकॉन टू गेट द नोटिफिकेशन ऑफ न्यू वीडियो क्वेश्चन वन फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स एंड एक्सप्लेन साउंड डज नॉट ट्रैवल थ्रू वैक्यूम बिकॉज साउंड वेव इज लॉन्गिट्यूडनल इन नेचर इट ट्रैवल्स बाय मीन्स ऑफ वाइब्रेशन्स ऑफ द पार्टिकल्स प्रेजेंट इन अ मीडियम हेन्स साउंड रिक्वायर्स अ मटेरियल मीडियम फॉर इट्स प्रपोगेशन एंड इट कैन नॉट ट्रैवल थ्रू वैक्यूम टू द वेलोसिटी ऑफ साउंड इन स्टील इज ग्रेटर दैन द वेलोसिटी ऑफ सैंड इन वॉटर बिकॉज साउंड ट्रैवल फास्टर इन सॉलिड्स दैन इन लिक्विड्स हेन्स Its velocity in steel is greater than that in water. Three, the incidence of lightning in daily life shows that the velocity of sound is less than the velocity of light, because when lightning is produced, both light and sound are generated at the same time. But we see the lightning first. and here the sound produced after some time four to discover a sunken ship or objects deep inside the sea sonar sonar technology is used because sound navigation and ranging is used to determine the distance and speed of an underwater object with the help of ultrasonic sound waves Question two: Explain giving scientific reasons. A. The roof of a movie theater and a conference hall is curved. In a movie theater or a conference hall, sound is produced at one place. These sound waves are usually reflected by the walls and ceilings. The acoustics of a movie theater. or conference hall should be such that the sound waves should reach everyone in the audience without any sound loss echo production reverberation after reflection to make this possible roof of a movie theater and conference halls are curved b the intensity of a reverberation is higher in a closed an empty house in a closed house the sound waves cannot escape and suffer multiple reflection from the wall of the house resulting into reverberation also a closed and empty house does not contain any furniture to absorb sound hence the intensity of reverberation increases in a closed and empty house C we cannot hear echo produced in our classroom echo of sound depends upon the temperature of the surrounding and the distance between source and reflecting surface to hear distinct echo at 22 degree celsius the minimum distance required between the source of sound and obstacle should be 17.2 meter in a classroom the ceiling is not so high and the distance between the opposite walls is usually less than 70.2 meter hence we cannot hear echo produced in our classroom question 3 answer the following questions in your own words a what is an echo what factors are important to get a distinct echo an echo is the repetition of the original sound because of reflection by some surface 
टेम्परेचर ऑफ द सराउंडिंग एंड डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द सोर्स एंड रिफ्लेक्टिंग सरफेस आर द टू इम्पॉर्टेंट फैक्टर्स फॉर द प्रोडक्शन ऑफ इको टोटल डिस्टेंस कवर्ड बाय साउंड फ्रॉम द पॉइंट ऑफ जनरेशन टू द रिफ्लेक्टिंग सरफेस एंड बैक शुड बी एट लीस्ट थर्टी मीटर दस फॉर द हियरिंग डिस्टिंक इको द मिनिमम डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द सोर्स ऑफ साउंड एंड ऑब्स्टेकल मस्ट बी हाफ द डिस्टेंस दैट इज सेवनटीन पॉइंट टू मीटर स्टडी द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ द गोल घूमट एट विजापुर एंड डिस्कस द रीजन्स फॉर द मल्टीपल इकोज प्रोड्यूस्ड देअर द गोल घूमट इज अ हिस्टोरिकल मॉन्यूमेंट इज लोकेटेड एट विजापुर इन कर्नाटका It has a smooth circular interior of a large circumference with a dome above it. Due to the circular structure, sound waves generated at one spot get reflected multiple times before coming back to the same spot, resulting in production of echoes. What should be the dimension and the shape of classroom so that no echo can be produced there the major factors for production of echo are temperature of the surrounding and the distance between the source and reflecting surface at 22 degrees celsius the minimum distance required for hearing a distinct echo is 17.2 meter classrooms should be designed in such a manner the distance between two walls of the classroom should be less than 17.2 meter classrooms are mostly designed in rectangular shape to avoid echo production question 4 where and why are sound absorbing materials used sound absorbing materials are used in auditorium and hall to reduce excessive reverberation the roof and walls of the auditorium are covered with sound absorbing materials like thermocol fiberboard rough plaster etc seats are made of sound absorbing materials so that excessive reverberation is reduced question 5 Solve the following examples. A. The speed of sound in air at 0 degree Celsius is 332 meter per second. If it increases at the rate of 0.6 meter per second per degree, what will be the temperature when the velocity has increased to 344 meter per second? Given speed of sound in air at 0 degree celsius is 332 meter per second increase in velocity of sound per degree is equal to 0.6 meter per second per degree we have to find here temperature so difference in velocity is 344 minus 332 is 12 meter per second For one degree Celsius rise in temperature, velocity increases by 0.6 meter per second. So, for x degree Celsius rise in temperature, velocity increases by 12 meter per second. So, one upon x is equal to 0.6 upon 12. We will find out the value of x. So, x is equal to 12 upon 0.6. After calculation, we will get the answer: twenty degrees Celsius. The velocity of sound will be three hundred forty-four meter per second at twenty degrees Celsius. B. Nita heard the sound of lightning after four seconds of seeing it. What was the distance of the lightning from her? Given Velocity of sound in air is 340 meter per second, and time is given four seconds. 
we have to find here distance and we know the formula velocity is equal to distance upon time we will keep the values 340 is equal to distance upon 4 here we we have to find out distance so distance is equal to 340 into 4 after multiplication we will get the answer 1360 meter so the distance of lightning from nita is 1360 meter c sunil is standing between two walls the wall closest to him is at a distance of 360 meter if he shouts he hear the first echo after 4 seconds and another after another 2 seconds 1 what is the velocity of sound in air 2 what is the distance between the two walls in this problem given distance of closest wall 660 meter time for first echo is 4 second and time for second echo is 2 second and we have to find velocity of sound in air and distance between two walls here distance is given 660 meter echo produced after time is 4 second so time taken by sound to travel given distance is 2 second and we know velocity is equal to distance upon time we will keep here the values velocity is equal to 660 upon 2 after calculation we get velocity is 330 meter per second now let distance between two walls be x so distance of observer from wall 2 is x minus 660 meter as total time taken by sound to travel is x minus 660 meter is 4 upon 2 plus 2 upon 2 is equal to 3 second so we will get the value of x after calculation 1650 meter so the velocity of sound is in air 330 meter per second and distance between two wall is 1650 meter d hydrogen gas is filled in two identical bottles a and b at the same temperature the mass of hydrogen in the two bottles is 12 gram and 48 gram respectively in which bottle will sound travel faster and how many times as fast as the other in this problem given mass of hydrogen gas in bottle a is 12 gram and mass of hydrogen gas in bottle b is 48 gram we have to find velocity of sound in bottle a and bottle b so our formula first formula is velocity inverse proportional 1 upon in root density and our second formula is density is equal to mass upon velocity now density of hydrogen gas in bottle a density a is equal to 12 upon velocity and density of hydrogen gas in bottle b density of b is equal to 48 upon velocity now we know velocity of a upon velocity of b is equal to in root density b upon density a so velocity of a upon velocity of b is equal to in root 48 upon v upon 12 upon v so velocity of a upon velocity of b is equal to in root 48 upon 12 after calculation we get in upon 4 so velocity of a upon velocity of b is 2 that means velocity of a is equal to 2 velocity of b so our answer is velocity of sound will be more in bottle a and velocity of sound in bottle a is twice that in bottle 
B E Helium gas is filled in two identical bottles A and B. The mass of gas in two bottles is 10 gram and 40 gram respectively. If the speed of sound is the same in both bottles, what conclusion will you draw? In this problem, we know mass of gas in bottle A is 10 gram and mass of gas in bottle B is 40 gram. And speed of sound in bottle A and speed of sound in bottle B both are same. That means velocity of A same to velocity of B. So molecular weight is constant. Velocity of A proportional in root temperature A and velocity B proportional to in root temperature B. Also velocity of A inverse proportional 1 upon in root density of A and velocity of B inverse proportional to 1 upon density of B. Here velocity of A is equal to in root temperature A upon density A and velocity of B is equal to in root temperature of B upon density of B. But we know velocity of A and velocity of B both are same. That's why in root temperature of A upon density of A is equal to in root temperature of B upon density of B. So in root temperature of A upon temperature of B is equal to in root density of A upon density of B. Now we will take squares of both sides. So temperature of A upon temperature of B is equal to density of A upon density of B. We will keep the values temperature of A upon temperature of B is equal to 10 upon 40. After calculation we will get the values temperature of A upon temperature of B is equal to 1 upon 4. That means temperature of B is equal to 4 temperature of A. So temperature of B is 4 times the temperature of A. So the friends thanks for watching this video. Again if you have any queries then please comment me. Till then bye.